right there. Very challenging. Can't complain about our forecast. We're not dealing with anything like this. We're just dealing with a lot we of heat. We are dealing with the heat, though. Mm -hmm. The heat is on, especially later on this afternoon, guys. This morning, you really wouldn't think we'd be <coughs> reaching the 90s. Well, that's exactly where we'll be later on today. On the Way 31 Skycam Network, we've got those temperatures in the upper 50s heading out the door. 58 here in Hudsville, 57 in the Shoals, and it's 56 in both Gunnersville and Decatur this morning. It is a bit hazy. Some of that wildfire smoke from New Mexico, it is moving into our atmosphere in North Alabama. No air quality concerns, but this haze will be with us for the next few days, as will the heat, of course. We are dry on the Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network. Temperatures climb very quickly over the next few hours. 9 a.m. will be in the low 70s, 85 degrees by noon, 90 on the dot at 3 o'clock this afternoon. Our forecast high today, 92. That's about 10 degrees above average for this 18th day of May. Now, as far as the feels like temperatures are concerned, the heat index, that will not be too terribly bad today. Still very hot during that peak heat and feeling like 95 later on this afternoon. Make sure you stay hydrated, wear the sunscreen, of course. But because of that wind gusting out of the southeast around 20, 25 miles per hour, that'll keep things from becoming too steamy later on today. Nonetheless, make sure you take care of yourself. You're going to be outside. That UV index is in the very high category, which means sunburns will happen in about 15 minutes later on today. Here we go with future radar. You do see some of those clouds building back into North Alabama by 4 o'clock this afternoon. This data source tries to squeeze out a couple of sprinkles in our Tennessee counties today. I think we'll be dry for your Wednesday, but that cloud cover will be around, especially later on. Waking up on Thursday morning, dry, but much milder than what we have this morning. We're in the upper 50s now. I think we'll be close to 70 degrees this time tomorrow morning, and then we might have a bit more moisture moving into our Tennessee counties, maybe Jackson and DeKalb counties tomorrow afternoon to where we can't completely rule out one or two showers. Nearly all of us stay dry, but we will keep that 10% chance for a couple of those hit and miss showers tomorrow afternoon, and we will just keep the same storyline going all the way through Friday with that mix of sun and clouds and those highs in the low to mid 90s. Our next big weather maker comes your way this weekend. Good bit of rain chances on the way, but this will be very beneficial rain. We have not seen much so far in the month of May. For Saturday in particular, looks like a few hit and miss showers and storms. A classic summertime day, if you will. Then as our next cold front gets closer on Sunday, I expect that rain coverage to be a bit higher. Unfortunately, Sunday is becoming more of a washout. I'm not ready to say it's a total washout just yet, but the rain chances will be much higher for Sunday as that front moves through. And eventually this front will start all out somewhere nearby it could be right on top of North Alabama it could be to our south either way that will keep the warm and humid air in place and that means lingering shower chances through the early part of next week too in general we will see around a half inch to one inch of rain the next seven days a lot of that this weekend but again it will be very beneficial given how dry we've been so far this month seven day forecast looks like this it's going to be hot 92 today 94 tomorrow 92 again on Friday and then as that front moves through while we do have some lingering shower chances it will be much more seasonable next week in the low 80s all right